You gotta know a day. Today we're going to talk about Alexander Fleming. You can see him here working with plates. Now, that picture looks like he's got a pretty clean lab, but in reality, he had a very dirty, notoriously dirty lab. And what he noticed is that his Staphylococcus, a type of bacteria, is not growing so well on a plate. In fact, what he found is that there was mold growing on it. And when that happened, he saw that all of a sudden this bacteria isn't growing at all. Uh, in fact, you can see it on the left here. It's popping. And of course, he had discovered uh, penicillin at this time. He didn't know it yet. In fact, what he just called it was mold juice. Doesn't that sound delicious? Uh, and he wanted to know how uh, penicillin worked. Now we know how penicillin works. Uh, basically, uh, bacteria, they've got these really great cell walls. They allow them to hold uh, you know, lots of pressure. It protects them. Uh, and they have enzymes in order to uh, really make those uh, cell walls solid and, ready and uh, you know, protective. Well, what penicillin does is it binds to that enzyme so it can't finish up the job of building its wall with little cross links. And so what happens is all that bacteria starts to fill in uh, with water because actually it's osmosis um, uh, that's causing it. And there's a lot of stuff inside it and some water rushes in. And then if the wall isn't made, pop, you see the bacteria um, actually die. Um, that's how penicillin works. Um, penicillin is shown to be a beta-lactam uh, antibiotic. Um, this structure here, the penicillin structure, was determined by Dorothy Crowfoot Hodgkins. Uh, finally got a woman on here. I've got lots of men, uh, but she figured out the structure of penicillin. It's a beta-lactam antibiotic because it's got this uh, little square with a nitrogen in it and this uh, oxygen bound to it. Again, square, nitrogen, oxygen bound to it. This is where it binds to the enzyme. So it can't finish its job and help the bacteria have that solid wall. That's why the, set, the wall break down. So again, Fleming uh, discovered uh, penicillin, really changed the world um, by helping battle bacteria. Um, and uh, that's what he's known for. Again, Nobel Prize, 1945.